Understanding Have the Rights, a guide for English language learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a very important phrase in the English language, have the rights. This phrase is not only common but also crucial in understanding everyday conversations, legal contexts, and social discussions. Let's dive into what it means and how you can use it effectively in your conversations. Have the rights is a phrase that implies possession or entitlement to certain legal, social, or moral privileges. When someone says they have the rights to something, it means they are legally or morally allowed to do it. For example, I have the rights to express my opinion means that the person is entitled to share their thoughts freely. Legal Context In legal terms, have the rights refers to legal entitlements protected by law. For instance, you have the rights to remain silent is a famous legal statement often heard in police movies, indicating a person's right not to speak during an arrest or interrogation. Social Context Socially, the phrase can relate to basic human rights or civil liberties. For example, everyone has the rights to freedom and safety, means all individuals are entitled to live freely and securely. Everyday use. In everyday language, this phrase might appear in simpler forms, like, I have the rights to choose my career, emphasizing personal freedom and choice. One common mistake is confusing rights with right. While rights refer to entitlements or freedoms, right can mean correct, as in the right answer or a direction opposite of left. It's important to understand this distinction to use the phrase correctly. We hope this video has helped clarify the meaning and usage of have the rights. Remember, this phrase is all about entitlement and freedom, whether it's in legal, social, or personal contexts. Keep practicing, and don't hesitate to use have the rights in your conversations to sound more fluent and confident. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next lesson.